Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this super fast video, I'm going to show you how to invert and correctly edit your scanned film negative in Affinity Photo in possibly less than two minutes. So I'm gonna give it a go. And without any wasting time, let's jump in. So I'm gonna select one of the photo, right click it and open with Affinity Photo. So it's gonna take some time. So excuse me for that few seconds of running and then the actual edit should not take less than two minutes. So it's open, I'm gonna jump straight to the curve and flip the curve right now like that and then go up and it should give me a pretty easy and good looking image. Now I'm gonna crop that image a little bit so that I get rid of all this white border at the top, at the bottom and that looks good. And now I'm gonna go to the lens Check the lens correction off, details, noise reduction off. In the basic, I'm gonna add more, like a less black so that, you know, uh, get rid of all the brightness because it looks super strong to me. And then add some more vibration. Now you must be wondering, like still not, doesn't look very good, right? So I'm gonna click develop. In the develop persona, I'm going to go at the top left corner and start with contrast the auto contrast and then beam look it's already looks fantastic now second thing i'm going to do is the auto white balance and then at the first one i'm going to click the auto enhancement for the levels all done right click it and then duplicate and on top of it what i'm going to do i'm going to reduce the brightness because it looks too strong to me. Do that, I'm gonna open level, put the level on the side, and there you go, it looks nice and quite less bright to me. That's done, and then I'm gonna open another layer and then go to the vibration of vibrance and add some saturation that looks nice and saturated to me. Now this is how Super quickly, you can use Affinity Photo to correctly invert and edit your scanned negatives. Um, the, the auto enhancement worked magic. I've tried many, many times. I invite you to use the auto mode as much as you possibly can. It will save you a tons of time. That's all for me. Look after yourself and bye-bye.